Welcome to Drone Hacks video guide number nine. In this video, we're going to be covering the Drone Hacks companion Android APK file, which will allow you to switch between FCC and CE on the models Mini 1, Mini 2, Air 1, Air 2, and the FPV Racer. To use this program, you'll need an Android phone, as it doesn't currently work on iOS, and you'll need to download the APK file. Before we do that, we'll just take a look at the information that is on the website. The new John Hatch companion app for Android. With our new companion app, you can switch to FCC easily on the go. The app needs instant access to work. It is currently available for five drone models as listed. Mavic Air, Mavic Air 2, Mavic Mini, Mavic Mini 2 and the FPV Racer. You need one of the supported drone models as listed above. The original controller of the drone, a smart controller, is not supported. You need an Android phone or tablet, Android 6 minimum recommended, with internet access. And finally, you will need a light license. You can buy the license here on the website. To download it, you can either download on your computer and copy the APK file over to your phone, or you can simply open the Drone Hacked website on your phone and download it from there. If you've already got the app installed, you'll now need to download version 1.0.7. Just go to the Drone Hacked website, click on the link, and then scroll down, and you're looking to download the Android app. Uh, if you want to just click on that box and then choose the download file it's not a very big file so it won't take too long once it's downloaded just need to click on open file and it will say do you want to install an update etc your existing data will not be lost you just need to click on install and it will then install the app once the app is installed, don't click open, just click on done. So now that we have the app installed, we now need to simply connect up our quad. Uh, if you're using the uh, micro USB type phone, you no longer need the OTG adapter. You can simply plug in your lead to the top of your controller here. We are not using the bottom port anymore. We are now going to use the top port. Plug in your phone. You'll now notice that your phone now pops up and it has the drone hacks companion showing on the screen. We're going to tap on that. Just click on just once wait till it finds the device and logs you in if you're not logged in before it will ask you for your login details as mentioned you do need a light license available from drone hacks uh, once you're logged in once it remember your login all the time then you just need to tap on enable fcc it will then say log setting region us and done once that's done i find it's best to unplug the phone and then close out the companion app and then plug back in the phone and then you can then launch the DJI Fly app. Remember to tap just once for both the Drone Hacks Companion and for your Fly app. We tap on Go Fly, and if we let it load, and then tap the three dots in the top corner, go to Transmission, you'll now see the 1KM mark sits above the 90 line. That means you're now in FCC mode on my Mini 2. Uh, the same rules apply if you're using a USB-C type phone. Again, you just plug it into the top of the controller here, not the bottom, as was with the earlier version. You just plug it into the top there and plug in your phone. And it all works fine. I have done some test footage, and I can prove that uh, I did get better signal strength over a, a short distance where I fly. I'll leave a link to that video below. Otherwise, thank you very much for watching. Drone Hacks Companion video number nine.